Lakeisha Grant, the CEO of Virtual Enterprise Architects. We're an IT consulting company based in the Washington, D.C. area. Well, I always thought I was different. I felt it was always a, an innate feeling that something was different about me. And to me, in order for you to truly be different, you have to really call upon those instincts and just act on it. You have to take the step forward, but it has to be an educated step. You have to make sure that you're armed with all the tools and everything that you're going to need in order to make that step possible. Inform yourself and educate yourself first, but most importantly, act. Don't just think about it. Don't just write it down on your vision board and never attempt it. If you never attempt it, you're going to always view that as a failure no matter what you do. People are very attracted to numbers. When they see the growth of small businesses like myself, they really feel inspired to look at their own goals and become entrepreneurs. We have nine core values. Our very first one is volunteerism. My internal staff, all nine of us and myself, we volunteer every third Thursday and Friday at a local food bank. I don't think it's ever going to leave our company culture because to me, family starts in your own homes and then in your communities and then it grows from there. That's pretty much how we stay true to who we are throughout this growth. My parents are middle class folks. They were rooted in South Carolina and they love everything South Carolina. That's pretty much how I was raised. When I first started the, the company and said that I was going to jump out and become an entrepreneur, they thought I was absolutely insane and crazy. Um, my mother did not understand it at all. So I made it a habit of not mentioning my business at all to her. I acted as if I was still working for someone else. I never really let them into what I was doing day to day. Last year, we were honored by the city in which the mayor held a press conference for us. And I told my mom, I said, hey, mom, the mayor's going to be honoring us uh, in about two weeks. And, you know, I'd like for you to come and, you know, attend. And so she said, well, what is he going to, what is he going to honor you for? And I was like, for my business. And she said, oh, well, what kind of business is this? You know, again, what, what do you do? I'm like, it's computers. So we had the press conference, and my mom proceeded to hand a camera to the mayor to take pictures of herself and me and my father and the rest of the family. She was turning to people saying, that's my daughter that they're talking about. She hugged me, and she said, I'm so proud of you. I still don't understand what you do and why we're having this, <laughs> but I'm so proud of you. I have a wonderful family that uh, has done, a, I think, a wonderful job in instilling a spirit of, of entrepreneurship as well as a strong work ethic. I've noticed in most of my engagements that not everyone has that same feeling or sentiment of we're in this together, we're a family. It's just not a sentiment that's consistently practiced. I truly believe that entrepreneurship is attainable, you know, for anyone if this country girl can sort of do, do well in a big city, you know, others can do the same thing.